Today we've seen a number of Republicans loudly break from Donald Trump. This morning Colin Powell endorsed Joe Biden for president. This afternoon Mitt Romney decided to march with Black Lives Matter protesters in Washington, D.C., the same protesters Trump keeps demonizing. The other day, Republican Senator Lisa Murkowski said she agreed with General Mattis' condemnation of Trump's presidency. Now another Republican, Evan McMullen, is piling on. McMullen, a former CIA officer, has long been openly critical of Donald Trump. Now he's explaining on Twitter why he'd rather have a Democrat for president than four more years of Trump. I'd rather deal with the fact that a Democratic president doesn't always agree with me than sacrifice all of my core principles and the health of the republic to support a dangerously incompetent conman because he happens to call himself a Republican. This isn't complicated. Of course, even as these Republicans continue to take a stand against Donald Trump, the vast majority of the Republicans currently in the House and Senate have either endorsed Trump's deranged agenda or remain silent. That silence speaks volumes. As Colin Powell explained this morning, any silent Republicans are complicit in Trump's atrocities, and they should be held accountable.